Ladies and gentlemen, we're here at our feature. No, 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 no. Just are stop you, it. Are you stop it right now? I hate this, this, this wild pair tag team tournament garbage because it puts stuff together like this, like this, and it's not right. It's not fair. Deal, uh, I'm gonna, have to I have to get down, down there to ringside. Now, sit down, deal. Now, ladies and gentlemen, while we're at commercial break, uh, Richard Crow had the audience pull out the participants, and there you see Diamond Dan and uh, Quicksilver not getting along. Diamond Dan back here in the PWI, and uh, lo and behold, deal. Uh, no, no, you, no, uh, no. When no. Dan come out, he chased Ring you. the bell. Where's the bell? Bellman. Your Ring man. the bell. This match is over. We're not going to wrestle him. Try to him. control yourself, deal. But your man, I'm trying to let the folks at home know what took place during the commercial. The first man introduced was Quicksilver. And then, lo and behold, Diamond Dan's name is pulled out of the bucket. These two former two-time PWI tag team champions known as Fire and Ice. And right now, they're uh, not getting along too well. Sit down, deal. No, this is garbage. This 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 is tag team tournament thing is a load of bunk. I can't stand it. Quick Silver's got to get in there, and once again, like he's done all those years, he's got to carry discount drive in. Oh, I I I I I, I got to get down the ringside. I got to get down the ringside. You'll sit down and you'll do your job here. I can't. I can't and, even and, concentrate. And remember, Quick Silver wrestled earlier in the day's program, so he's somewhat uh, winded, I would think, and. Uh, He's not real happy as Diamond Dan uh, taking a seat on the outside there. And we haven't even talked about their opponents. It's Billy the Kid and Johnny Utah, a fine young duo here that has been put together. Well, all I can say is I guarantee you this, if Quicksilver's in the ring, then they're going to win the match. If Diamond Discount Dummy That's Dan, Diamond Dan, him too, if he's in the ring, then, then they're going to lose. Dan and hey, because be... Dan can't even see. He can't even see the guy. Well, it looks to me like he can see, see pretty well. Quick no, no, tag no. And he's chasing he into thinks... the back of International Arena. And uh, these two may have a match somewhat like TJ Powers and Austin James did uh, a few weeks back when they were subsequently drawn well, to be a tag team. No, he doesn't tournament. think that's Quicksilver. I guarantee you. He can't see who Maybe it is. Maybe he thinks it's you. Well, he, he, he might think it's Hey, Diamond Dan, he's over here. Oh, if, if he wants a piece of the deal, I'll send Quicksilver right after him. He probably thought that was Billy the Kid over there. He can't see well, you. Well, we're not that. sure if his vision is one of Oh, it's not. It, what do you mean we're not sure? I can tell you right now that it's not. It's about well, 10%. Well, you must have thought it was pretty good when you hightailed it out of here. No, no. Set out, deal. I need to be down there. I need to be down there for my man Quicksilver. Quicksilver needs to be over there in the well, corner as uh, Billy the Kid opens up on the uh, left arm of Diamond Dan. Well, I can say as they may be partners right now, but tonight it's all over at the International Arena because Discount Dummy Dan's going to get torn from limb to limb, and I'm going to be there with a basket to get all of the parts that Quicksilver throws out the ringside to me. I understand that uh, Quicksilver might not be in attendance. Oh, Quicksilver will be there. He's not a coward. He knows Diamond Dan will make his official return tonight at the television taping. Oh, I can uh, And Quicksilver's looking forward to it, just so we can put this. him out again. Uh, well, that yet yeah, that remains yet to be seen. Nothing. That remains to be seen. I think one strike and uh, you're out. I don't think just, you'll uh, get another. I, I'm going to go get a seat. I'm going to go get a seat. You, know, you need to sit down. You're awful nervous over there. Well, I don't like this. I don't like... My man being in the ring with somebody that's half blind. You know, you've not uh, fared too well of recent weeks here in the PWI. What, what, what do you mean? I haven't fared too well. What did you see in that opening match? What do you? What did you see? Oh well. Quicksilver won the match, and I Trash losing it is undefeated. What's that? He's what's undefeated. He's what? never been beaten. You understand what? What, 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 what are you talking about? Oh, oh no, Quicksilver! Oh, I've just been told, deal that. Uh, Commissioner uh, Gary Frazier is going to be looking at the tape of that opening matchup and might reverse the decision where you might go home with the loser's no, no, share of the no, purse. No, old man Frazier's not going to do anything like that to the... Oh, and there, there, your man took it right on the mush. And the PWI fans ecstatic over that particular move. That may be get the uh, move of the day here. Uh, the I, I need to get a little town. Right? Of course I'm going to be there. I'm the uh, stinking federation. Your man Quicksilver will be there. Diamond Dan is oh. officially signed on that. Good. Well, I, hope he, I tell you what, I'm going to throw up the challenge right now. Discount dummy Dan. If you want a piece of Quicksilver, why don't you sign a match for it? Huh? For it. 
Huh? Why don't you sign a match? We'll take any stipulations you want. Well, yeah, maybe that's what he has signed against this Quicksilver. Uh, that a tremendous card this coming Wednesday night, May the 1st at Shooters. That being sponsored by Budweiser. I can't and wait to get sure. there and have a few myself. Uh, I'm gonna like shake you, up you a couple. Get Bud Light. I'm gonna shake up a couple bottles and spray them on all the ugly fans at ringside. Uh, I don't think you'll do any of the sort. Uh, you watch me, Billy the Kid, uh, taking it to Quicksilver, who was, I think, looking towards Diamond Dan and uh, doesn't want to make the tag deal. Oh, Your Dan, man's in trouble. Dan's a coward. He doesn't want in the ring. You'll see that. Uh, you want to talk about? The, uh, I gotta be in this stinky. Sit down, deal. You're not going to ringside. Horrible town of Indianapolis for a week, for four days, whatever it is, Saturday yeah, to Wednesday. True, I don't want to be there. will be stopping by uh, to do the television tapings there at International Arena. In fact, we've got uh, uh, PWI television tapings the following week on May the 4th, so you're I gotta spend just, a week in Indianapolis. Oh, I, I have to fly back and forth. Oh, I hate uh, Indianapolis. I understand you're going to be staying there at your aunt's. No, I, I don't. None of my family lives in that godforsaken city. Now that is the home base of PWI, thank oh, you. Oh, yeah, that's... So that what is going on tells here? Tells you everything uh, you need to know. Diamond Dan wanted the tag and Quicksilver wouldn't do it. Stinking Federation and a stinking well, there's town. there's a tag. Now that uh, somewhat reminiscent of uh, somewhat getting along there. A little, both men a little leery of one another. Dan with the side headlock. Well, I don't know why Dan would be leery of... Uh, Quicksilver. Well, when you're Diamond Dan and you're in there against Quicksilver or with Quicksilver, you got to look over your shoulder because well, I, you never know how many more of the cannonballers are going to come out and interfere in the match. Hey, that's a good idea. Let me uh, sit down, deal. to the back. Get that EK guy or whatever that guy's name out of here. Hey, I'm Billy! I'm going to ban him from... Billy! Bill, come here a second. No, he didn't hear me. Quicksilver apparently reluctant to tag... Diamond Dan. Oh, on this. he's not reluctant. He's not reluctant at all. Well, then why wasn't he on the side of the ring where he belongs? He's going out and giving oh, him a now there's a, kiss. Now that's not supposed to happen that way. Well, Diamond did Dan. You, did you tell him to do that? Diamond Dan's so clumsy that he ran into Quicksilver. And now I think Diamond Dan's going to go after Quicksilver. And oh, these you got to wonder if this is going to break down. Oh, Billy the Kid comes from behind. And it's a three Rolls count. Up. That's a two count. Quick. Referee needs to disqualify Quicksilver and let Diamond Dan wrestle this match alone. That if he disqualified Quicksilver, wouldn't he, dummy? No. Wouldn't he, dummy? Let me let me read the rule book to you. The rule book doesn't apply to the Wild Pair Tag Team. Do well, you remember well, that a few I'm weeks all, ago when Eric where, Freedom was tagging Rex? He tagged where, him on the outside. Well, I'm gonna get a I'm gonna get an official over here. Put your glasses on, Bill. I'm gonna get an official over here, Bill. Bill. Young Johnny Utah. I can't get a hold of Bill. Young Johnny Utah. Oh, reverse there by Diamond Dan. Nice hip toss. I think he needs a new battery for his hearing aid. I think you need a new battery for a lot of things. We're going to need one for a pacemaker here pretty soon. I'm all upset. Oh, Quicksilver oh, made the quick tag. Silver. Tagged him. That is a legal type tag. Uh, Dan, you need to Dan's get out of the ring. You Dan. haven't done anything at all in this match worth anything. Quicksilver. Oh. Hooks the leg and gets the pin. One, two, three. <laughs> oh, look at the ego on Quicksilver. Is this guy's head enough he to fit the building? Oh. Is there enough mustard on that hot dog? Quicksilver. The winners. Diamond Dan and Quicksilver. Well, it should only be Quicksilver listed as the winner of this Well, match. Mr. Ego himself. Oh, Quicksilver. No, 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 Diamond no, no, Dan no, opens no, up. No, I gotta go. Quicksilver go, still sit down. down. Whips him oh, into the road. No, no, no. Big backdrop there by Diamond. Deal, get over here. Uh, let me tell you something, Diamond Dan. Uh, I hate Dan. you. I hate you. I don't care if it's tonight at the International Arena. I don't care if it's May 1st at Shooters. What we did to you last time is going to look like child's play when we run you out of wrestling once and for all. As the credits roll, ladies and gentlemen, this oh, is Eugene Donaldson for The Real Deal. We'll see you again next week on the Powerhouse of Wrestling. Deal, sit down. I hate him.